looked around and we did our, our research and we decided that we wanted something that had more of a community feel to it. And so that was what initially drew us, you know, to Westside. Found in you a sweet community, a family. We are brothers, sisters too. I think one of the great things about Montessori that we've seen is it really has taught Maya to not just be independent, but to want to be independent. And I feel like sometimes it's her mom. I try to do things for her when she is perfectly capable of doing herself. And so she's the one who reminds me, you know, I can do it, I wanna do it. And I've had a couple of conversations with her teachers that have helped reiterate, yes, encourage that, encourage that independence, let her try, let her get frustrated. All of those feelings are normal, it's part of development. And she surprises me every time definitely a different type of learning than what we were used to with my son and we didn't really know what Montessori was going into it but I mean I think another amazing thing about the school are the teachers and the notes that they send home every day the pictures which oh we love getting the pictures from the teachers and seeing the activities that Maya is doing when they send home the pictures you again don't really realize at first but it does help us kind of connect the dots once we see things like her language explosion and you know her pincher grasp which is like approved immensely and that was something that she struggled with um, it's all just like a compounded activities that they do every day